It's a pleasure to have with us tonight his first and only ever interview, Admiral General Aladdin, the Supreme Leader and beloved oppressor of Wadia. Do you have favorite leaders, favorite other oppressors? There are very few of the great dictators left. All the best ones are now gone. Saddam, Gaddafi, Kim Jong, Cheney. My favorite, unfortunately, is dead. Who? You know, I miss uh, Kim Jong, uh, KJ. I miss him uh, a lot, you know, he was, uh, he was a fun man. He died as he lived in three inch heels. But he was ruthless to his people. No, <laughs> he's not ruthless to his people. He was a sweetie pie. By the way, was there any fallout following the Ryan Seacrest interview when you walked down and you, you attended the Oscars for some reason? You know, Seacrest dealt with it very professionally. After all, it's not the first Asian guy to end up all over his chest. Have you ever failed at anything? Well, if you look up Israel on Wikipedia, everything is still in the present tense. So that's clearly something that I need to work on. I'm Jewish. You Jew are Jewish? Yes. You are, you are Jewish? Yes. Fine, no problem. Because I am Jewish, you would take offense, you would spit No, it's nothing to do with that. The, the, I just spit on the floor. I see, so I had nothing to do I with I don't that. like the floor. All right, let's get right to it. Do you have nuclear weapons? <laughs> what was the question? Do you have nuclear weapons? Sorry, I can't hear you. Are you developing nuclear weapons? No, I literally can't hear you. I'm going to another question. Oh, I can hear you now. You made some astonishing claims over the years that you invented the Pentium processor, mm. that you're next in line to play James Bond. James Bond, yes. And that you coined the phrase, take a chill pill. Take a chill pill. What does that mean? It means, yeah, relax, you know, if things are getting hated, take a chill pill. President Obama has said that you've lost the legitimacy to rule, you should step down. I said, him. It is hurtful that he is saying that. It was my father, after all, that helped smuggle him from Kenya as a child. Wait a minute, are you saying he was not born in the United States? Of course not. The interview is over. Sahar Bring me Pierce Morgan! <laughs>